this town shows the world that there were some determined folks. It's pretty significant what those people in Nicodemus wanted to have. Ownership. Community. Faith. Family. Education. Business. I'm proud to be part of it. It's my story. I'm a direct descendant of that first group that came out in 1877. My great-great-grandmother was one of the persons from Kentucky. That was a Williams, and I am one of those. <laughs> To leave Kentucky was to attempt to better yourself. Nicodemus was just a spot on the prairie. They went to the churches in Kentucky to recruit people to come out here. Guide me along the way. So it's not like they got out here and all of a sudden got faith. It's been an ongoing thing from the beginning. Out here now, faith is what's keeping a lot of people going. People that came to Nicodemus had a good business sense. There are some basic things that everyone needed. The businesses in Nicodemus saw those opportunities. They had a resource of skills that they could immediately put to use. My grandmother was the first African-American postmistress in Kansas. It was in a hotel where overnight guests could stay. My mother had a little restaurant inviting locals to come in and eat. In slavery, it was strictly forbidden for them to be educated. This one community has put out so many teachers. She hit the ground in 1877, and by 1878, she was teaching in her dugout wading through the water to get to the schoolhouse. The schoolhouse was district number one. It was always chaotic, but it was fun. And our children, they're able to excel and exceed way further than what I was even able to do, so we take great pride in that. What it must have felt for those people when they built the township hall. I carry a lot of that pride because I know my grandfather was involved in that. We think about homecoming as it relates to that building. There were a lot of families here, and then they spread it out. Homecoming represents the time when we come back. You'd get to see your cousins you don't get to see normally. When it comes time for roller skating, that was a big deal. You didn't need to wipe out or you know, hit this and roll over it. First time I ever seen her was she was coming out of the township hall, and I was speechless. All I could say was, hey, say. <laughs> And then you get a whirlwind like Angela that says to make sure the history continues, we need to make this into a national park. And I mean, heavy duty congressmen, sign it into legislation. <laughs> we'll be here forever. But Nicodemus was just my home. Pretty much been home all my life. It's just part of my life.